Uh, corporate identity is working with a client to help them brand. I thought that a lot of what happens in the area in which students are located um, impacts how passionate they are. If you're passionate about something in your community, you're more likely to continue with it and really push for it, um, as well as doing something that's just not an in-class project. You're not just developing something for a class and you're like, oh, it's another class project, whoop to do it's, you know, nothing better than what I did for my packaging class down, you know, an hour later. Um, this involves actually creating something that helps other people beyond the classroom. We started at the beginning of the semester where Samantha Barber, our instructor, had told us to go out and find a nonprofit organization that we wanted to represent and take under our wings and branch out and give a new brand to. So we all voted on it. We saw that Hope House needed our help the most. We saw that their brand wasn't conforming with what they were representing. So we all came together, voted, and now we're on it. I actually had the opportunity to go to Hope House uh, around eight years ago, and so my first impression was it was a lot homier than an institution. It had a lot, uh, a lot more character to it just because it was in one of the older homes. So first impressions, I thought it was a, a genuine place for comfort or to get off the streets. Uh, my first impression of Hope House when I first saw it was that it was a... Um, a shelter we really need to look into. Mm -hmm. um, I didn't really know much about it, but once I visited, that's when I really got my first impression and I knew that we were in the right place. I learned how to work better with teammates and understand their perspective and see their vision as something that could be possible and not just the way I see things. I learned most that design can be more than just like a school project or something you see on a logo or billboard, but it can actually help your community and make a big impact. I learned a lot about um, how design can impact the business because usually with design you're just like okay I'll design a poster or I'll design like this product or something and it's just like a simple design like a Nike or something like that. It's not really going to have that much impact but design really impacts on who sees your product, um, um, the awareness of it, and also it connects well to the message of the company like co policy and worthiness. Graph design is more than just design, it's more like branding, you know, For the pieces that I worked on, um, I worked on the donation page and the volunteering page. Uh, the way I designed it was so that people would have an easier time getting to choose what, exactly what they wanted to donate. For an example, for the donation page, we have really clear, um, really clear 
symbols for everybody. They can just go bam, slap the button, and it'll take them directly to where they need to go. And it'll have it transfer, and it'll have it uh, sent directly to the Hope House. Um, and volunteering, you'll be able to see everything that previous workers have done, every everything that you should that you're it's going to be expected of you. Hope. Trust. And expansion. Friendly, family, and humble. How do you to describe Hope House? Generous, loyal, godly. Thank you. I feel like the Hope House represents um, encouragement, hope and comfort. Us. Uh, caring, diligent, and sincere. Three words I associate with Hope House have to be hope, worthiness, and change. Words I associate with, with Hope House are growth, because it is growing, um, help center for people, and a beacon of hope for people. Um, I think it's comforting. It's, it's really homey and it's a safe haven.